see what is the shortcut to find out the base current and the base impedance in the case of the star connected three phase system two things will be given to you the base power will be given to you and the base voltage will be given to you the base voltage of a three phase system is 220 kilovolt and it is always line to line voltage and the base power of a three phase system is always the three phase power it is given to you so without converting the three phase values the three phase base power and three phase base voltage on a single phase basis how can we directly find out the value of the base current and the base impedance to get the value of the base current remember we can use this formula directly this formula can be used to find out the base current in the star connected system directly because see always remember this base current is the current which is flowing in the phase which is flowing in the phase remember in this formula this voltage is line to line voltage and this current is the line current so this current this base current which you which you are going to find out is the line current this line current in the star connected system will flow in the phase also so this line base current is the phase base current so by using this formula directly we can find out the value of the base current but this formula if you are using for the delta connected system to get the value of the base current the answer will become wrong so always remember in the case of the star connected system you can directly use this formula to find out the base current see the base current will be s base divided by root 3 vb and we can put the value of the three phase power three phase power and this is the line to line voltage the three phase base power is 60 mega volt ampere divided by root 3 220 kilo volt you will get 157.45 ampere to get the value of the base impedance you can use this formula directly the line to line base voltage is square divided by s base three phase and put the value 220 kilo square divided by 60 mega you will get 806.6 ohm this formula for finding the z base in the case of a star connected system is true but if you are using this formula direct formula in the delta connected in the delta connected three phase system to find out the base impedance it will become wrong so you have to remember it and be careful See, I have told you the conventional approach. Uh, the same problem I have told you in the previous video. The three-phase system, a star connected, base power 60 MVA, base voltage 220 kilovolt. In the previous video, what I have done, I have converted the three-phase system in a single-phase system. Convert the three-phase system on a single-phase basis. So the base power of a single phase system will be 60 upon 3 and the base power of a star connected sorry the base voltage of a star connected three phase system will be 220 upon root 3 kilo volt so you will get 127.02 and use these two values use these values to get the value of base current and the base impedance and it will never go wrong i will tell you uh i will discuss the three phase system which is connected in delta connected which is uh, connected in delta in the next video so use the basic approach if you are getting if you are getting a lot of headache then use a very very basic approach convert the three phase system in a single phase system or on a single phase basis थ्री फेस सिस्टम को सिंगल फेस सिस्टम में आप कन्वर्ट कर दीजिए और सिंगल फेस सिस्टम की वैल्यूज़ को 
आप यूज़ करिए कभी भी आंसर गलत नहीं होगा